we've got um, the project there, what we need to do is to start adding some files. So um, the first thing I'm going to do is to just go back to my um, initial empty project here and I'm going to go file, new file or project and I'm going to choose a C++ and I just want a C++ source file and we'll create a little main in here so we're going to choose the location to be SRC and we're going to create main.cpp we'll click on continue there we're going to add it to the project NGL Pro if you're using version control you can add it to the version control I've not got that configured at the moment and we're done and we'll hash include q app location we'll do an int main and we'll leave it like that and that should happily build um, but what we will notice um, if we go to the console is that it's put our main.o in the wrong directory we'll, we'll, we'll figure that out um, in a little while and, and get that tidied up and that's going to be within the Qt profile but for now the next thing that we need to do is I want to create a user interface um, file and the associated C++ classes for it so again file new file or project and we're now going to um, select from the Qt option there and we've got a Qt designer form class you'll see here it says create a Qt designer form along with a matching class header files and source files so we choose that it now gives us an option um, of the type of window we want we've, we've got a series of widgets that we can create we've got dialogue with buttons and so forth and what we're going to create is a main window application so it's like a full-on main window and we can choose the default size and everything else so that we'll stick with the default and if we get on continue now we've got the option to name our class and where to put all of the source files in this case what I want to do I'm going to keep main window it's a good enough name but I want to tell it to put the header files in the include directory of our project that we've created the source file in the SRC directory of the project we've created and the UI into oops didn't want to do that the UI into the UI um, area of our project and the path will set to QTNGL and what that should do now is to create these files for us and an empty form for us to start using so add to the project QTNGL.pro click done there you can see that it's now popped up with our GUI ready for us to put some widgets on and everything else and if we look in the console we should see in the source that we've got main window CPP we look in include we've got main window dot H and if we look in UI we've got main window dot UI so QT's put everything in the correct areas that we want for our project